My camera won't focus. I wonder if this lighting is good. Wait a second. <laughs> I'm looking crazy right now, y'all. I'm about to go into my wax appointment or oh, whatever. My wax appointment isn't until two. It's 1.55 right now. I finally made it on time, y'all. If you know me, you know I'm always late to everything. But I'm actually on time today. And I'm actually really tired. I don't know if you can tell on my face, but I haven't had a wax in like over maybe two months. And I'm kind of whooping, okay? I'm kind of whooping, so I'm really scared. It's gonna feel like the first time. I hope she's not rough. Y'all, look at my nails. Look at, I'm looking crazy right now. Look at my nails. I have my nail appointment on the 6th, so I'm really excited about that. I need these nails done. I've been looking rough. I've been looking crazy, okay? That's what I'm talking though. I'm gonna go inside. Yeah, I have a YouTube channel. It's cool. Lately, I've just been feeling burnt out. Like, for the past year, I've just been feeling burnt out. So, I haven't been, like, taking it too serious. But I'm starting to get back into it now. Only thing for us is just consistency. Like, so hard to stay consistent. Ready? No, but you can go ahead. I just finished my work. <gasps> it's hot as fuck in here. This fucking mask off. I just got wax, bitches. Ah, I'm so proud. Surprisingly, it didn't hurt too bad. I said that I would never probably get used to that pain, but it wasn't too bad. I don't know why. Like, it just hurt for a split second. I'm not sore or anything like that. Sometimes you don't get a wax for very long. A little sore or painful? I don't know. Comment down below if y'all feel that way too. It's 2.51, so it took like an hour, 50 minutes, whatever. I didn't tell y'all this, but I'm about to go get some tooth gems. So basically this girl who hit me up like two days ago, she was asking if I wanted to get some free tooth gems done or like some promo or whatever. So that's what I'm about to do. I'm about to go meet up with her and get some tooth gems done and I'll see y'all when I get there. Okay guys, so I'm here. Gotta get my teeth done. Cute little bear, it's so cute. <laughs> here are all the juice. Gonna be stocking up more. Pink right here. Yeah, this definitely lighter, want pink. I'm so excited. <laughs> this thing feels so weird. So hard, this is the process. It's a heart and then a flower and a butterfly. So cute. Do a four on the bottom. If you're in a DMV area, y'all should definitely come to her. Hey guys, so I'm finally done. Thank you so much, no Sparkly Jim. So glad you if like it. If you're in the DMV, check her out. And she's also having a discount or sale right now going on. So mm -hmm. I'll leave her information and everything in the description box. So you make sure I check her out. Yes, come through, get icy. So I am back home now. It's like way later. I got my teeth gems done. Ah. I love them so, y'all don't mind my lace, I'm looking crazy, okay? Literally love them so much and I can't wait to take pictures, aesthetic pictures and do all of that there. Like I said in the last clip, make sure y'all check her out. Her name is Sparkly Gems on Instagram. I'ma leave her name 
down below and in the description box y'all can check her out she was super dope and super cool she is licensed but she is just now like she's just starting out getting serious but she needs more exposure and more clients and stuff i mean you see it you see my shit dancing i know you see you see the material i just wanted to check back in with y'all and show the finished product she said it'll last like at least a month like one month guarantee after i got my teeth done i did stop by the thrift store and i got some items not too much i guess i'll show y'all one second first off i got this bag y'all is this bag cute or what i mean i thought it was cute my mom said it looks like a doggy bag though <laughs> but i thought it was like a cute little summer bag be if i go on a picnic or something or just a beach bag i don't know i just thought it was cute and it could just give the next item this skirt was actually brand new with the tags on it like a little athletic skirt pink one of course and then it has shorts at the bottom item i picked up harley davidson tank top like it's black with little rhinestones on it i also have these pants sweatpants the brand is pink y'all look i took my nails off oh my god i get my nails done on wednesday i'm super excited i need to hurry up and figure out like what design i actually want my eyebrows are looking crazy my hair is looking crazy i'm about to take my wig off right now tomorrow's tuesday so i think i'm gonna do my eyebrows wash my hair give myself a little facial my hair itches so much I think the last time, time that I saw y'all, I told y'all I was gonna get my nails done, but I never got them done. So, I'm about to go get my toes done right now. I'm not sure what I wanna actually get on my feet. I'm thinking about doing a pink French tip. I've never gotten that done on my toes before. I have to go to Target and pick up a few items. One of them items being there, cause girl, I'm heavy on my legs and I don't shave my legs. I'm trying to get into like ask my legs, but I don't know if I'm ready for all that yet. Too. So, so I lied. I actually came to the next one, and I'm getting my toes done. Y'all haven't had a pedicure in so long. This feels so good. Period. Ooh, can I believe? <laughs> my favorite part. I didn't even turn the seat on. Honestly, I don't even be liking these seats though. Like, these salon chairs be hurting me. I definitely lied to y'all. I said I was gonna go to Target, but I decided I wanna get my feet done first because I don't wanna be walking around Target with crusty toes. So that's all I really have to tell y'all. I will see y'all when my toes are done, child. I'm back home now. I got my toes done. Like I said, I did want to go to Target. Picked up some lotion, got some nair, and I picked up some fade cream. I use this on my body. I do have a little bit of body acne. It used to be really bad, like really bad. But I found like some products. Like I have a whole body care routine. This is a part of it. I use some fade cream on my body. Got my toes, y'all. Super cute. And I'm thinking about putting little rhinestones, like across my big toe i'm not sure yet i think it would be cute so y'all today is thursday the 14th and i'm getting my nails done today finally oh my God. it's been too long it's been too long about to be on my way to my nail appointment my nail appointment isn't until 2 45 but it's all the way on that side like it's literally like an hour away and i want to get some food before i go because i haven't eaten all day i just finished getting ready i'm about to go my slippers i think i'm gonna go get some wendy's the wendy's fries is torch i will see y'all when i'm at my nail appointment or when i'm on the way there i still want to talk when i get there because i don't know what i'm getting on my nails y'all I don't know what I'm getting done to my I just made it to my appointment. Right now, I'm just waiting for Lex to come and pick me up. There was so much traffic. Why I thought I was going to be on time? I was on time, but why I thought I was going to have time to spare, child? It was so much traffic. It was like a three-car accident. It was real bad, but I made it here, and I got my um, Wendy's or whatever. I'm going to come back, and I'm going to do this. My nails going to be done, bitch. I'm so excited, I'm getting duck nails. Something like this. It's gonna be so cute. I got forms on my nails. Oh my gosh, duck toes. Hell no. I'm gonna do that to be funny on myself. Oh. 
Look y'all, this what we got so far. I'm so happy. I literally never had duck nails before. And this is her first time doing them, so period. Yo, my nail tech's so nice. She got us biscuits from her lobster. I love these biscuits. I love bread, cornstarch, cornstarch. Fenugreek or fenugreek, whatever it's called. Oh yeah, I've heard about that feeling. Supposedly, it makes you smell. Like syrup, right? Yeah. Who the fuck wanna smell and taste like that? I was confused too. I just feel like that's not, that's a weird a smell. It tastes like, yeah. Yeah, like, why are you walking around smelling like syrup? I heard it makes you fertile. Fertile and it makes you slippery. All I heard was fertile and I'm like, yep, never mind. <laughs> never mind. Look at my nails, y'all. Ah. It's the shape. All of that. You scrub your nails in the bathroom. You can keep that little cap on it. Thank you. Know? you. <laughs> my nail tech is so nice, always giving me stuff, y'all. Alright, yeah. So I just washed my hands. Now it's time for the chores. I love these stars and the Hello Kitty. So cute. Oh my gosh, this Hello Kitty is so cute. Look at the nails. Ah, so cute. Who you know? Who do you know? So y'all, we almost done. She just have to do the top coat, and then we done. Material world. Not exactly. That's exactly what it is. Hey guys. So. It is like way later. Way later than the clips that you just saw. I have my nails done. Hello Kitty on the middle finger. Y'all know I love to put my middle finger up. Cause fuck a nigga, okay? My duck nails, I love them so much. Shout out to my nail tech if you're watching this. I love you, girl. I'm about to shower right now. We're getting into like the self-care part, like the actual self-care part of the vlog that I've been waiting so long for. I just really wanted to get all of my appointments and stuff out of the way. I'm about to do my facial, do my eyebrows, shave my legs. Well, I'm not gonna shave, I'm using nair, but get into all of that good stuff. My nails are done, bitch. Like, I love getting my nails done. Like, that's my new obsession lately, getting my nails done. I just love I'm it. about to shower, and I just wanted to show you the product. So this is my nair. I just got this product, so I can't say too much about it. I'm hoping that it doesn't stink. If you know, you know. This is my Ambi Fade Cream, my deodorant. Some cocoa butter, coconut oil. It's like a body butter, honestly. This smells so fucking good. Like I can't even describe it, it just smells so good. Then we have our Nivea. And then, y'all, the essential. This is some body oil, I think it's called Pink. P-U-S-S-Y. And this is my Oriental Vanilla from Dossier. So these are my essentials, y'all. Every time I shower, this is what I use. It is the next morning. I know that I said I was gonna come back after I got out the shower, but I got tired and I was just like, you know what? It's probably better to film this in the morning anyway. So yeah, I just like to put these whitening strips on while I just get ready for my day. I need to do my hair, I need to do my eyebrows. I need to give myself a face because that is needed my skin my skin mm -mm. oh my god I can't do shit with these nails um, this is what it looks like y'all don't mind my skin I don't even want to come up close I have to get my razor this is essential I have my little kit of tools here's my little tweezer I also have my little eyebrow brush so these are the three things that you will need I'm gonna go in with my razor and I'm just gonna kind of like clean up my skin I love and hate doing my own brows because I just feel like it's so nerve wracking because like one wrong move and your brows are fucked up. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, bitch, my bro, I just got them done. I am about to do my other side and I don't think I'm gonna talk at all through that part. So I am back from doing my brows. Oh, they came out so perfect and so symmetrical. I'm 
I'm fresh faced. So all I'm doing is filling the water up. Just put it in the bag. I'm just gonna let this steam in my face for a little bit. If you don't have one already, you need to get a facial steamer. Especially if you're somebody who loves skincare like me. Oh my God. This after a long day or this after a long week where you just wanna like literally pamper yourself. I really just be in the crib giving myself facials. <laughs> Already my skin is looking bomb under the mask like hello I should have did a before and after picture of my skin because this facial that I be giving myself is that girl she's the truth that's why I'm throwing shade like it's sunny Make sure you're moisturizing your neck because the older you get, you want your skin to just look young and healthy. You don't want to just get like 50 years old and your skin just be saggy. So here's my skin. You can't tell me. You can't tell me I'm not glowing. You can't tell me my skin don't look healthy compared to what I looked like before. My skin was looking real dull. Now it looks real healthy and moisturized. So I don't know if I'm gonna see y'all tomorrow. I might end this vlog today. I did everything I needed to do. I got my toes done. I got my wax. I got my nails done. I did my brows, my facial just now. And that's really all I wanted to do to pamper myself. So I'm in my room right now. I know y'all never really have seen my room and that's because I never really liked my room, you know? My room isn't too messy. It's really just my bed, and I just have some clothes that I need to fold, but they're in the dryer right now. I'm gonna start by cleaning off my bed. Take a sip of my chlorophyll water. And I get back to work. I hate putting my pillows inside my pillowcase. I just feel like it's the hardest task ever for no reason. Y'all, this is my heated blanket, okay? If you don't have a heated blanket, what you doing? If you don't have a heated blanket, honestly, what the fuck are you doing with your life? The workout, it is to vacuum your room. My arm is burning. I'm gonna show y'all my room now. I probably should have showed like the before and then the after transformation, but that's okay. Here's my room, here's my bed, here's my little TV area. I don't really use my TV, so I don't care so much about that. The vacuum cleaner that just almost took my arm out. My favorite part of my room, I love this part of my room. What do you call this? My clothing rack area, I guess. And here's my Hello Kitty mirror that I love so much. And then here's my other mirror, my full body mirror. You know like when you clean your room and it's feeling all good and bomb, you have to light a candle. So of course that's what I'm gonna do. And this candle is from Dossier. They are a fragrance company. However, they do have candles on their website now. And the best part about it, their candles are literally perfume in a candle. Like, brilliant. Imagine your most favorite fragrance. Imagine having it in a candle for your room, bitch. So this candle is called Floriental Vanilla. It's a dupe of the YSL Black Opium Perfume and it just smells so bomb, y'all. So I'm about to light this candle. Ouch. 
I just burnt my fucking finger. So make sure you check my link in my description box if you're interested in getting a candle or a fragrance from them. I'll probably see y'all tomorrow when my hair is done and I look like a bad bitch. So y'all can see the full effect of what pampering yourself gets you. So I love you guys and I'll see y'all tomorrow.